hurts a little bit. Sorry about that. Okay, hello YouTube. This is Trudy. Um, first off, Tyler is doing really, really well. Our doctor's appointment went good. He now has this flow meter thing. Let me show you quick. For those of you that don't know what it is, and let me see if I can open it. Hold on. You gotta push the button? No. Oh, there we go. It looks like this. <coughs> right, pull, pull it up. Pull the bottom part up. And what you would do is you would breathe into this part and it shows how well uh, your breath pressure is. Uh, whatever. And this is where Tyler should be. And usually on a bad day, well, the first time he did it, he was about to there. So. He's got a little bit to do, but right after he does a nap, he can usually get all the way up there. So, uh, to where he's supposed to be, which is good. Um, but, yeah. So, we got that today. We had to pay for that because insurance doesn't cover it. It was, like, $26. Um, and then we had the other problem with insurance. Um, Christy had mentioned that she takes prenatal vitamins for her vitamins and so my husband and I both checked to see if we could get it. Now I thought for sure that being my husband was a male they were never going to uh, set that through but they did and so he got these prenatal vitamins. Now the funky part is is I can't get them. My insurance will not pay for them so if I want them I have to pay $22. He only has to pay a dollar which is still a savings for us but it's just really weird that they will okay it for a man, but not for a woman. So, that's that. And then also today, um, I was doing a run around with the gastric bypass center. Uh, first they tell me they don't have the COE, then they tell me they do have the COE, and then they tell me that they're compiling a list of those who need to have things done and whatever, whatever, whatever. So, after many, many phone calls and much frustration, uh, it has gotten down to that as soon as there is a date, they are calling me, which is excellent, I guess. Uh, it's still looking at us like another month or two before I'll get a call because the other doctor that was doing surgery there hurt himself last year and has not back yet. They are getting another surgeon in a week and a half. Um, if we are given the option of switching to the other doctor, um, we will do that. And I will probably make that call next week saying that, uh, if, uh, if that gets us in faster, I would be willing to switch. Um, but, uh, yeah, um, that's all that's going on. Um, getting ready for school. Our school starts here September 2nd, uh, so we have a lot to do, uh, a lot more stuff to get, uh, but we'll get there. We always do. Um, other than that, there's not a whole lot, a lot going on. Just waiting, as I always do. I can't say I've been as great on the diet. I have to get back on the wagon again after being in the hospital. I kind of slipped a lot and uh, was eating whatever I could get a hold of because hospital is not great when you're really low on money for having the best food um, for dieting and all that so um, yeah so talk to you later bye